Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In this video, we are going to give the answers of those interview questions which I talked in the previous shot. But before getting started, if you like my videos, please subscribe to this channel. So let's go to the questions. So the first question was, does lightning data table supports lookup week? So the answer is no. Lightning data table does not support lookup field. In case if you have to show the lookup fields inside your lightning data table, you have to customize the overall LWC component and your lookup field. In case if you are going to render a lookup field, you have to create a custom lookup from your own end inside the LWC component. So the answer is no. Lightning data table does not support lookup fields. So if you are trying to render a lookup field, a normal lookup field inside the lightning data table, it will just show the ID of the record. The 18 digit like uh, 005, one, something like this, the ID will be shown inside the lookup field. So let's move to the next question. Next question is once we have a formula field of let's say text type, okay, we have a formula field of the text type, can we change the data type of that field to something else? So let's try it out quickly. So do I have a formula field over here? Okay, don't have it. I think so. Okay, so I'm just going to create a formula field. Test. And then I'm going to create a formula field of text type. Right, the formula field is of text type. I'm going to, going to click on next. And then I'm going to put a name field inside it. Let's say account name itself. Check the syntax. It's working fine, and I'm going to just going to save it. So this is the test formula field. Let's try to change the type of this formula field. So if I click on edit. I don't get the option of change field type over here. Usually we get it, but over here I'm not able to get any kind of change field. Like if I go to a normal field, so this is one of the this is one of the field which is a custom field. So this is where we all get the option, right? Change field type. We can change the field type to something else, but in case of formula field. Once you create a formula field of certain type, you won't be able to change the data type of that field. So answer is no. We can't change the data type of the formula field once it is created with certain type like text or checkbox or anything like that. Let's move on to the next question. According to the next question, <clears throat> what are the few different ways to send a text SMS using Salesforce? So according to my knowledge, there are three ways we can send an SMS to the external uh, if you want uh, to send a text message there are three ways so one of the way is i think so is integration what we can do is we can integrate with the third party uh, which will be uh, which will be uh, responsible to send an sms so what we are going to do is we are going to set up an integration with the third party and then we are going to make a request to this third party to send an sms and then this third party will send the sms so one of the ways integration next of the way is twilio Twilio or any other app exchange app, right? So either you can use Twilio or app exchange app, which will be al already configured. All you have to do is you have to put the data and then it will start working. You can use the Twilio or any app exchange app, which is responsible to send an SMS. And the third and the final one is nothing but digital engagement. So digital engagement is also one of the way we can send an SMS uh directly text sms to anyone using digital engagement so in digital engagement there are three ways you can connect with your customer one of them is text sms another is facebook messenger and another is whatsapp messages so these are the three ways integration is i think so most cheapest way in order to send an sms digital engagement needs certain kind of licenses 
but in case if you want to send in text sms but if you want to work with facebook messenger or anything like that digital engagement would work as a free but in case if you want to send a text sms then in case you have to buy certain licenses twilio is also a paid app so again you will need some kind of payment but in case of integration all you have to do is you have to pay the third party to send an sms that's it and you can write your own code to send the integration let's move on to the next question now according to the third last question what kind of relationship is there between a contact and account so the relationship between account and contact is lookup that is lookup relationship okay the relationship between the contact and account is lookup relationship but only the casket delete checkbox or casket delete functionality is open for it so that's the reason why once you delete an account contact will also get deleted but basically the relationship between account and contact is a lookup relationship if you found this video helpful please 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 do subscribe to this channel